this is an update and actually I want to talk about the asteroid not comet I guess it was a comet but now it's an asteroid that will be coming through on Rosh Hashanah September 15th into the womb of Virgo now we talked about this before but we're gonna make some corrections it is an asteroid as stated in this video now I don't know for sure but it sounds to me that this comet or asteroid or both it's been told to me it was a comet now it's an asteroid but I'm just gonna put the link in the description box you can decide for yourself what you think this is but it states in this video it's an asteroid it goes into the constellation Virgo on September 15th, Friday night, and it'll be visible to the naked eye, and it will be on Rosh Hashanah, which begins at Friday night, September 15th, into September 17th at sundown. Okay, that's the beginning of the new Jewish New Year. So I wanted to state that because I have another thing that I had to correct. It was named child after a scientist whose last name is child. I think his name is Jack B. Child, if I'm correct. And in the video, it states that too. So he discovered this asteroid and named it after himself. Of course, the scientist that discovered it in 1989. I didn't know that. I thought it was discovered in 1920. Yeah, I said that in a previous video, but that was coming from another video. Now, Robert Breaker broke this from another video. Um, I'm trying to think of who was the one who broke the story, but the story was broke from, let me see if I can find it. don't know if I can find it real quick, but um, it, it actually broke from a story. It was a breakaway from a story, from a story. So it's like that, you know, you get the information and before you know, it gets back to the original story. So this is what I know from now. The link is in the description box and you can see from your observation what you think this revelation.com revelation12.com video he states a lot of information he also has the charts and here's something i didn't know about the mercury i'm sorry not mercury but mars the planet is in the vicinity of the womb that's always been known as the red planet. We were talking about the red planet, but that's the planet that we were talking about. That also is in the vicinity of the womb, meaning the catching away of the church is right before it. Mars has a chance to catch away the child. So this is astonishing. This is a sign in the heavens that oftentimes is mentioned there will be a sign in the heavens before the coming return of the Lord. So this sign being the Revelation 12 sign, as mentioned in Revelation 12, 1 and 2, this is what everybody's been asking and wondering what is going on with this sign. We saw it in Revelation 12, 1, 2 in September 23rd, 2017. Why is this appearing again? So this is the sign that it's reappearing. And this time it doesn't have 12 stars on its head. And why now? Well, we can line it up with all the other converting, converging events that are taking place. So this is worth watching the video. So I wanted to come back on, clear up any misconceptions of anything, and also get you that link so you can watch it for yourself. Thank you for watching. Have a blessed Sunday and have a safe 
Labor Day weekend.